The new stars is off a 3.23 EP2 patch just dropped not too long ago, and we're going straight into the patch notes. For this one, features and gameplay in the character category. They said uh, they did an update to the character customizer, and they've added DNA blending slider. Under location, they fixed some unnatural shading on subsurface ocean foam. On the gameplay, they did shopping experience update. It says set shopping pedestal to work properly with the connected entity added correct building blocks uh, canvases to the pedestals added string for types under the purchasable component for all vehicles and some other items corrected some racks that were displaying ui incorrectly they've updated the star map list items to match the rest of the moby glass and um, under ships and vehicles they've added progress bar to ship scanning ui interesting um have to take a look at that they did an update to the argo mode master mode flight uh tune in to introduce individual characteristics uh, miss prospector hp tune in to introduce individual characteristics and a tune in adjustment to backwards linear acceleration ship weapon balance decrease damage on non-charge aries ion bullets on the core tech they did a water visual performance tuning pass server performance optimization pass vulcan performance polish pass there's a few bug fixes with this one as well they fixed an issue where you're unable to purchase vehicles from kiosks they fixed an issue that's causing the mayrock to not spawn on microtech in multiple biomes they fixed an issue uh, causing much fewer copian to spawn around locations in the pu let me tell you i have not seen either <laughs> all right i've been playing 323 since they dropped it man i have not seen either all right um uh they fixed the uh, rental uh fails for uh, most fps equipment in arena commander they fixed an exploit where it says it's possible to achieve limitless boosting by pulsing the afterburner into around 24% in SCM. They fixed an issue where full screen mode Vulcan renderer with a lower resolution than the native monitor results in a small full screen. They fixed an issue where entering and exiting vent near landing pads for corporate entrance causes players to fall through the environment. This happened to me once before. They fixed an issue um, where searching for a match will always load a new instance despite other matches waiting for players. They also fixed an issue where infinite loading screen disconnection. 30,018 uh, error when two players launch from lobby. Along with this is five client crashes, four server crashes, and a Vulcan client crash. You guys already know what to do. Leave a like, subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one.